We are at the Charlotte Beer Garden. Yeah, who knew you could get beer at a garden? selection of on tap beers okay so when you come to the beer garden right yeah when in Rome yeah so we got beer mm-hmm we've got a flight of five ounce beers and I'll tell you um, the names of the beers in just a little bit but if you're just joining welcome to the show everybody it's Sugar Girl Studio Kitchen Live, and if you're watching, go ahead and like, comment, share this video. Let everybody know that your girl's eating good in the hood today. Mm -hmm. We're out and about in Charlotte, and you know, the weather is getting so nice. This is really my, you know, why I wanted to start this new series, like now, because it's just so gorgeous so gorgeous and I've been cooped up in the house I've I've been a good steward throughout this whole COVID pandemic um, now I'm getting out and seeing the site so we're starting with the beer garden today all right the website is sugarpearlsonline.com YouTube is sugar pearls and Instagram is sugar pearls underscore online now yes okay so let's start with the flight okay so we're going to start with our flight. I'll tell you what they are. Not that it makes any difference. I haven't had them before. Okay, but we're going to try it. Okay, the first one I have, and you should know, okay, fun fact. I chose the beers based on the alcohol content. Okay, so these beers have fairly high alcohol, like where I'm talking above 10. Okay, we'll see how they taste okay now, I'm not a huge beer drinker I'm not I like beers and there are a couple that I really enjoy and I don't really venture out of that but I'm at the beer garden so okay here we go this one is beer is dead okay this one had the highest alcohol content beer is dead no it's not this is luminosity sorry I wrote it down luminosity here we go That tastes more like the beer that I like. It's kind of citrusy, not too bitter. Mm. I like that one. Okay, this one is beer is dead. Bottoms up. Mm. Oh, it's sweet. It's really sweet. I like sweet beer. Wait, let me taste it one more time to make sure I don't like it. Yeah. Um, not a fan of sweet beer. It almost tastes like blueberries. Tastes like fruit. Tastes like bubble gum. Remember Hubba Bubba back in the day? Hubba Bubba? It tastes like Hubba Bubba. They should call it Hubba Bubba. All right, next, this is Booty Cone. You know I chose that one. Yeah. All right, here we go, bottoms up. Oh yeah, strong favorite. Um, this, this one, Luminosity and Booty Call. Mmm. <laughs> it's not super cold I wish it was much colder um, but that's my fault because I ordered it like a half hour before y'all came on okay alright now I'm going to try this one that I spilled a little bit but that's okay because I probably won't finish it anyway this last one is a cider 
and it is um, way crossing. Now this is a Charlotte cider. We've got a lot of breweries here in Charlotte, so if, if you come here, you're gonna get a Charlotte beer, I'm sure. And Charlotte really does have some good beers. Let's see what this cider is. Ooh, cider -y. It's got less of the, way less of the beer, way more of the apple, way more of the cider. Not too much kick to it. I'll put this over here. These are my favorites. Ooh, yes, honey, we are at the beer garden. So when you're at the beer garden, you order beer, right? L'chaim. It's good. I like, I really, really like that. Okay, that was Luminosity, and what did I say? Luminosity and Booty Call, my favorites by far. Okay, all right. Now, another favorite. So when I came, I made sure to ask my server what was like some of the hottest menus on the item. Items on the menu, backwards. <laughs> and she said, definitely the burgers are great. Um, but you know, I'm not a burger person. But if they're good at it, then I'm gonna try it. So I ordered the poutine. The poutine is, um, you probably had it, I'm sure. Um, it's a very Canadian, very Cleveland thing. Um, lots of beer cheese on top of fries with cheese curds. Yeah. I'm not a fan of all that, but I have to taste it because I'm here. Where? At the beer garden. So it's what you do. Okay, you order fries. It's really like a, um, I'm going to show you around a little bit while, while they bring my curves. Let me show you. Look at, can you see the, um, <laughs> see, it's lovely. Look at that. All the way, yeah, that's a whole nother section over there. Whole nother bar. Excuse me, sir. Are you the manager? I'm one of them. It's so good to meet you. <laughs> I was wondering, how many yeah. beers exactly do y'all have on tap? 436. 436 beers on tap. Okay, so that is the largest in the world. Okay, you win. Ooh. All right. <laughs> All right, I wasn't following you. I was <laughs> so No, you're good, you're good. <laughs> I was sick of it. Be careful of all Ooh, okay, thank you. Yeah, no okay. Guys, we've got dish. Look at this. Okay, so this is your Canadian slash Cleveland go-to I'm high and I'm hungry meal. Let's just be real. Okay, this is that. Hi, Danny. Look at this. So, with the poutine, you got your fries, you got your gravy, you got your cheese curds on top of this. I want to just ooh, get into it. Let's go down. Hey, boo, thank you so much. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's tear in. Ooh. Come to think of it, I had a, um, my old dentist. I'm a dentist now. Ooh. I like cheese curds. But I've never had it like this. It just look oh okay okay those curds I'm trying to show you.
those curves are good. Change your life. But this here will put all of that weight that I worked so hard to get off <laughs> back on. <laughs> so let's get a couple more. And we're gonna order two sliders. And that's gonna be it. Okay? But I just wanted to come to the beer garden because it's outside. I ain't gotta be inside a restaurant with a whole bunch of people. Okay? I can be outdoors. And it's right down the street from my house. Like legit less than four miles. So I was like, why not? It, it looks good. <laughs> Recognition, honey. Are you doing a vlog? Look, he told me I better be getting some recognition. <laughs> I don't talk about Charlotte Beer Garden. Put my side up. Yeah, we're going to put it up there. Put yes, honey. There. <laughs> I like you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna flip it yeah. right now. We can see. I already took them around a little oh, tour did? up top. Yeah. Did you? I did. Awesome. I did all the things. Did you yeah. Check them back over there. I didn't because I didn't want to disturb the customers. Come on, come on. Oh, you come in with me. oh shoot. You come in with me. Oh, shucks. Oh, God. Watch. Will you watch that real Here, quick, please? I'll be right back. Oh. We're going on a tour. You should be able to see the whole uh, skyline. Oh. But I've only got two, two seats now where you see everything. Oh. 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 Show it off. Look at that. Beer garden. Oh my god, look at the skyline! Look, that's, the that's it. That's it. Y'all got the best view in the city. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, thank you so oh, much. Uh, uh, you're, promote, you're promoting us. No, I'm gonna do what I say. That is so sweet. Oh. What's your name? Steven. Steven. Steven, I'm Carla. Nice to meet you, it's Steven. such a pleasure to meet yes, you. Oh my God, y'all gotta come to Charlotte Beer Garden. Where we at? 1300 South 1300 Tryon. South. Yes, Honey, I already told him. You got it. 1300 South Tryon. Y'all better come in here and see my boy Steven. Mm -hmm. Get you a flight of beers. Make sure you get that booty call. You yes. Sweetie. Thank you. you. <laughs> booty call. That booty call has um almost like a okay. I can say it with y'all because y'all most of y'all grown ups, right? Most of y'all grown ups cover the little kids' ears if they own. You got kids on right now? Just tell them to do that right there. Okay, I'm gonna say something. Cup Kennedy, close your ears. Okay. Um, it kind of tastes like weed. Just a little bit. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Honey, that was good. Mm. All right, no more cheese curds for me. That was delicious. I, I get it. The gravy is not like brown gravy I'm used to. It's, it's, a, it's definitely Cleveland. Cleveland gravy. But it's good. Hey, man. Oh, man. Simple, though. It shouldn't exist. You got fried, french fried gravy made with fat, cheese, milk fat. Ain't nothing but a booty call. It tastes like a booty call. Mm -hmm. Something that's real good but shouldn't be. And then you be mad at yourself after you have it. That's a booty call plate. And let that happen. Mm, regret on the plate.
there. Okay, I'm gonna say something. I'm saying, oh, 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 oh. Okay, I'm gonna say something. <laughs> so, is it just me? Or is it maybe it's because I'm out and we've been cooped up for a long time. And this is my first time really seeing people. But do you, when you at a place, do you count how many black folks there? Do you do that? Or is it just me? Huh? Okay, so I'm gonna count black and brown folk. All right, I'm gonna count, this just on the rooftop. This ain't the whole restaurant, this is on the rooftop. I don't know why I do that. I just I just count just to make sure in case I need some backup I know <laughs> to look for my look for my people, my cousins. And it's seven it's six of us in here. That don't mean nothing. That just means there's six of us in here. That's all. I wasn't saying that to make any kind of point. I'm just noticing. I told you. I watch. I notice. That's my job. I notice. I see my sliders. <gasps> you don't mind me asking, uh, yeah. what's up with uh, this? This, so, um, I'm like blogger, <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm host of a cooking show, and really? instead of being in my kitchen tonight, I'm out letting you're you guys giving, cook. Giving like a little review, kind of, yeah, that's cool. That's yeah, cool. it's awesome. You're great, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> People are, I tell you, Charlotte, it's like so you get the city life with the down home vibe. So you'll just have random folks just talking to you. And it's so cool because that's a lot like country life. You know? I'm not gonna eat that tomato, probably. I don't know, I, I feel funny about eating all the people's, um, I got my sliders by the way. So this is the uh, filet mignon, it looks like it's sliced. It's got some caramelized onions, some horseradish sauce, on there, not nearly. Oh no, it's some on the bottom. <laughs> my bad. Don't judge. I'm gonna eat it first. Okay. And then I got my little shrimp po boy slider. Okay. And this is the little shrimp. So it's it's like one shrimp cut in half. It's the slider. Okay. It's the slider. Okay. So it's just one um, shrimp cut in half. I bet it's good. Hey, thank you. Good. Let's start with this one. Yeah, I just took my uh, aligners out, so my teeth are kind of sensitive. So I'm gonna start with this one. Hey, this is shrimp po' boy slider from the Charlotte Beer Garden, 1300 South Tryon Street, Charlotte, North Carolina. It's a brioche bun. It's good. It's good. It's good. You don't drop no shrimp, child. You ain't got but one. No bells, whistles, or nothing. This is shrimp, fried shrimp on brioche. This is 
one that I'm excited about that I'm probably going to have in the morning. But this is the filet mignon flatter. Caramelized onion. Mm. I love some fried onions, honey. All right, let's give it a taste. Definitely the shrimp platters. Mm-hmm. Not shrimp. Filet mignon. This is good. This is what I want in the morning. Look at that. It really just kind of falls apart. It's good. Mm -hmm. Not super seasoned, but it's tender. It's got a good flavor. Okay, confession. Are you ready? <laughs> So before you came on, because I was here early, I had a Caesar salad. Now that Caesar salad was wrong. I'm talking about chunks of like baby romaine and um, some bruised grape tomatoes, red onions. Oh, it was so good. It was so good. And a homemade coop, um, Caesar dressing the head on it. Oh, it was so good. It was so good. Um, Caesar dressing. Filet is my favorite. Mm -hmm. And I'm full. Doesn't go, wow. but it's um, is pub food. Can I say that? That's not insulting, okay? <clears throat> when you out bar hopping, um, hopefully not now, but this would be a cool spot to like come by and pick up some some good food while you out drinking too much. Mm -hmm. It's that spot. Definitely a place after the booty call. That was good. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Yeah, so before you came, I had a Caesar salad and a drink. Um, so I'm stuck. Yeah, this is not going to be the show where you just watch me, you know, gorge myself. Like, no. Mm -mm, honey, I, I worked on this. All COVID. No. I ain't about to blow it on a couple of burgers. Right here? Yep. I'm glad I got out. This makes me happy that um, despite everything that uh, has gone on in the past year and change, we here. I look at these people out here, you know, having fun, just, you know, just enjoying their lives um, in the midst of a pandemic. We're still in a pandemic. 
So, um, it, it's just a wonder that, you know, we're still able to be able to do something like this and just celebrate life for a little bit. Uh, I marvel at it. Um, I realize that this this is quite a feat because <laughs> this time last year mm -mm. as a matter of fact they were building this place last year I saw it. I would pass it every day on my way home they were building this place Can you imagine the faith that it takes to go on with a plan despite what it looks like Ooh, 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 sermon it, yes, somebody, yeah, you say, I know, people got money, yeah, they got, but don't nobody want to throw no money away, I don't care how rich you are, somebody still had the foresight to say, you know what, we're still going to build it, we'll build it, because there's something on the other side of this thing. That's faith. That's faith. Just makes me think. That's probably the way you should live your life. Probably. I don't know what tomorrow holds. I don't. But I know there's something on the other side of this. <laughs> So I'm gonna plan for it. I'm gonna prepare for it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be ready for the next thing, whatever that is, and be willing to reinvent myself in the meantime. Mm, sometimes you gotta tell yourself that. Sometimes you gotta do that. The show. Just a reinvention. That's it. Not abandoning anything. It's just you know, you move with the times. You recognize what's on the other side, so you move accordingly. Moving at the speed of opportunity. Okay? Mmm. Okay, I ain't, I ain't gonna go so deep in it, but... Yeah. Take this time to just look around. <laughs> Wherever you are. And just marvel. Look at these ladies, but they look matching tops and jeans so I didn't think nobody did that no more. They three are they sisters. No. Anyway. Um but what it was so what? So what you gonna dress alike? Do it. Do it. It may be coming back. I watch. I notice. They paid me to notice, honey. Mm. All right, let's wrap up these sandwiches and go home. Let me serve it. I know she's tired of me sitting here. Mm. That really is quite tender. Um, and it tastes grilled. It's a good little slider. Could have introduced it to a little more salt, but it's good. I might want to recreate that. Mm -hmm. When you get a chance, I'll take the check. Thank you. Seven. Oh. This is good. This is almost like a celebration for me just to be out. <laughs> 
It really is. Like, it's such a celebration of life. Being able to do stuff like this. Hey. <laughs> okay, so I'm a, I didn't take a picture about a beer garden sign because I was waiting. Well, I thought I'd be able to use my um This is it. Got my thumbnail. Charlotte Beer Garden, baby. Oh, I gotta show you. Don't forget, I gotta show you the uh, the tax. What did he say? Four twenty-six. Yeah, over four hundred. Over four hundred beers on tap in this place. Why would you need that many? But I don't. People, people love beer. Hmm. Gotta go downstairs anyway, but I'll show you the the beer bar, the beer bar, beer wall, beer room, beer house, beer hut. Oh my God, there's so many beers. start packing up until she brings my box. I hope she remembers my box. If not, I'll just roll in the napkin and keep it moving. Okay? Okay. Just in case she forgets, child. Cause it's starting to get busy. Boom. Got that. We're gonna take that. Okay, I got my bag. Okay. Me. I'll be right back, ma'am. Okay, no worries. This service is great. Just a couple more minutes, and then we're gonna be going. That was pretty cool. I ordered some of uh, the most popular items on the menu the traditional poutine, that was the fries, the gravy, and the cheese curds. And then we had the Caesar salad, which is <laughs> primo. 
Um, the dressing on that Caesar salad was so good. Um, so yeah, Caesar salad, we had that first. What else did we have? Um, oh, the sliders, shrimp po' boy, and filet mignon with the caramelized onions. Um, we had our flight of our four different beers. Cool, thank you so much. So yeah, we, honey, we done ate good in this hood and drank good because the booty call was on point. Okay. That they're keeping the flying. Okay. We got our, let's get, all right, are you ready? Ready to go? Okay, get your stuff, let's go, come on. Okay, my Aldi bag of equipment ready to go. You have a lot of Thank you so much. You too. <laughs> that was nice. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Uh, that way. There we go. Oh no, you're good. Thank you. <laughs> See, I told you everybody's so freaking nice. Oh. All right, let's go down to ground floor. Excuse me. Bar. So there's another bar on the second floor as well. So there's a bar on every floor. So that's why the drinks come so fast. Because <laughs> you got a bar on every floor. Nobody has to go far to pick up drinks. Isn't that awesome? Okay, I'm gonna show you downstairs now. Okay. Isn't it cute? I know. Look at the vibe. See? It's a cute little spot. Okay, is that somebody's dog? I think it is. Okay. Oh, look at that. There's stuff try on. Marriage your Charlotte Beer Garden. Okay. Oh, this is cool. And there's a big tree in the middle. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Hi, thank you. <laughs> All right. Hey. Hi. Hi. being locked up for COVID. How do you feel? Yes, are you good? I know, everybody's good over here. We're good, so I just parked just down the street. But look, I'm trying to see if you, you so you can't really see um, all of the skyline here, but I'll just show you. So that way is uptown. The city is up there. And it's a really, we've got uh, Bank of America building, some other, Big buildings up there, some nice rooftop restaurants and stuff. You know, some real bougie looking city stuff. Really good. Um, maybe one day this summer we'll get up there so I can show you around. Uh, I think you'll enjoy it. But was this nice? I would. We got out. We had us a little datey date. And now, is my car still there? Yes, God, thank you. Um, I'm pleased. Please. Dinner was good. We got a little snack for later. And Jeff Gordon's, um, oh, the race car driver. Children's Foundation there. 
you know, as long as I've lived here, I still don't know all these nooks and crannies and everything that's hidden inside. But um, there's just so many little spots in Charlotte that are cool. And I'm still discovering, even after being here <laughs> since 2007, <laughs> I'm still discovering Charlotte. So, um, I don't know, maybe, maybe you can discover something where you are. Hmm? Hmm? Is there a new restaurant in town? You've been dying to try it, child. Grab your mask and go. Go. Enjoy. Eat good in your hood. Okay? Because I'm going to show you what's in my hood. So when you come see me, then we know, you got an idea of what's around so we can go. Okay? But wherever you are, honey... Wherever you watch it from, I don't care, New York, Mississippi, Alabama, my peeps in Carolinas, wherever. Eat good in your hood. And I will see you next week. Thank you so much for tuning in to a Friday live edition, the premiere episode of Eating Good in My Hood. Honey, let me go on in this house before the lights go down. All right. Bye. Bye. Go home. Bye.